Hey guys, it's uh, Full Blown Fascist here. Um, just doing some random videos. Um, trying to think of what I want to do today. Uh, I was trying. I was kind of thinking of doing like maybe some building projects I could feature on the channel, or I might make an alternate channel and just do it there. But like, of course, leave your comments down below on which I should do. Um, it's not gonna be like anything like building like some big fort, like, like a freaking mansion in, like, downtown Louisiana. Okay, that made no sense. Um, it's basically just gonna be, like, like, pallet stuff. Just building that. I'm planning on building a, uh, oh, what is it called? An altar tomorrow at the creek that I've been usually doing my videos on. But since it's pretty, it's getting kind of dark and there's a lot of mosquitoes out right now, um, I'm not really gonna do it out there, so uh, I just decided to do it inside. Here, I'm gonna go inside. Oh yeah, here, let me show you this. Uh, Justin made a flag for here for the Greek. Uh, I printed it out, so that was kind of cool. Oh, I should probably turn this off. Bro. Okay. Um, I was kind of maybe kind of thinking about reading a book um sorry about the mess um maybe I was hey here's an idea I'll go self defense pretty good um yeah self defense all right um self defense it's it's kind of a complicated thing like, self-defense could turn into something more than self-defense. It could be turning into a full-on assault, I think. Um, the problem with self-defense is, if you kill the person in self-defense, how are you going to know that, that it was self-defense and you didn't just straight-up murder them? Like, I've kind of understood how cops are our enemies now. I've seen a lot of videos about how the cops are pushing people to... Not, they're they're oppressing their rights as an American that are given to them by the government, which the cops are literally serving. But they somehow think that like they can just control us because they're a cop. Like that's not how it works, man. Like people, I'm not saying like po people should be fully in charge of the government, but people are a very key part in the system of the government. But like, I could see, like. A dictatorship it works but it just doesn't work for everyone I'm sure there's a lot of people like give me my rights I want to be able to shoot you because I want my rights like if a dictatorship works why not just leave it alone you know I mean of course it's nothing good if like they're going around killing people you know like you're black um um you're a Mexican <laughs> You're over 60? No. Then that happens. You know, like... Okay. Bro. I could've exploded that. Okay. Um... Yeah, but like, the police? They're too controlling. Like... The police need to be monitored. It, something you probably don't know about me. It's actually kind of my dream job to be a police. Just because I can prove the other people that are calling the police, like, you know, they're all that bad. But, like, I want to be that one cop that's like, you smoke weed, but I don't really want your life to be ruined because of this one thing, right? Like, if you smoke weed, you get in trouble for it. Your life's entirely ruined, man. Like, you can't get jobs. People will think you're too lazy. Maybe you're... Maybe they'll think you're, like, a pothead or something. That's just messed up, man. You, like, you should just give them a warning. Like, I can get it. Like, I mean, I don't do this, so... Mr. Rosos, if you're watching my videos, I don't do that crap. I, I'm not a pothead. But, uh... This video's gonna be short, by the way. Um... I'm just saying, one time... Like, give them a warning, dude. Like, it's gonna ruin their entire job thing. But, like, I could, I don't know. 
one person. Just no, no two people. I'm not going to name names, but I don't know who they are. But if they get caught, it's their problem. But I'm not saying, like, put them in juvie or something because of one time. Maybe it's the, really their parents' fault and their parents are supplying with them with that. My cousin actually does that. But, uh, well, my step cousin actually. His dad provides him with weed. It's really messed up. It's a terrible family. But, uh, yeah, that that thing. Um, I think the people should be required to be armed because in Sweden, right? Sweden, they have tw uh like twelve percent crime rate or something like that. It's like really really low, like two percent or twelve percent, something like that. Maybe even two twenty two percent. It's just something with two in it. All right, they have like something two percent of crime rate. Because every single person in the entire country has to be armed if, you're, if they're over 18. Like, that's a great idea. If everyone's armed, then how can you, like, rob someone when everyone's armed? So, like, how are they going to be able to do that? But, like, and I think self-sufficient living is ideal living. Like, communities, right? Like, they're good and all. But if one thing falls, then it's going to affect the entire community. Now, if, like, one per- like, everyone individualized, but then also united, united, like, I'm not high, united, like, as a people, but, like, individualized to have their own homes and be self-sufficient, like, if everyone had solar panels, if everyone had rain buckets, right, that we caught the water in, right? And that's how they got all their water, and all their power comes from the solar panels, and all that jazz, right? And then their food, farmed or hunted, right? I mean, you can be a vegetarian, I don't really care. Personally, I think it's like some kind of thing against God, because God literally put the animals on here to be feeding us, and we don't take that offer from him. And I think that's just kind of offending to God, but, I mean, I'm not God, so I don't know. Um, but like farming or something, yeah, like, that's a good food source. I'm not saying you don't need meat in your diet, but yeah, like, that's a good food source. Um, like, of course you can get, like, still milk and stuff, like, get, like, raised cows on your farm or something, right? And, uh, like, people can't really rob your house if you're all self-sufficient. But if everyone armed, everyone's armed, then people could unite in, like, Plans, and then be like primitive, cause that's not really cool. But like, you could also be like smart. You could build like your like really big commune, right? But like, it's all fascist, like uto fascist utopia. But like, that's how it is. Like, I swear I'm not high. I swear I'm not high. But like, it'd be cool if everyone was like in a clan, right? But it was like fascist utopia clan, or like. really primitive clan go, goes around like Roman Empire style they just take over people's houses and like have kids right <laughs> and then like it, it's just it just grows right and then it's and then it's a it's a it's a people it's a population of people but it's people they're united right and that unification bonds them together to make like a Okay, I'm probably going to end the video here, just because I have to. I'll see you all in the next video. So, uh, peace out, I guess. So, sorry for the mess.